first I want to apologize for doing all the crying and wiping my nose throughout the video I have a cold as well as this light it is fucking with my eyes like my eyes are so sensitive ever since I had my surgery so I put the light out of my face but I need the light to see so you can see the color and all of that other stuff so I'm crying for you bitches I'm like really being irritated right now by the light so that lets you know I love you cause I'm crying for you bitches you feel me anyways <laughs> anyways um this wig is opal through model model as you seen throughout the video it was originally a one until I added a pop of color that's the purpose of the whole video to show you guys that you can customize a wig you know better than some of the people that make the wig <laughs> you know what I'm saying anyways um I got the idea from someone that left me a message here on my pixie wig Missy Grando and also uh, Michelle Williams uh, she's the actress and she has a, a channel here on YouTube as well and she added some tracks to her natural hair and it, it looked good so I said let me add some tracks to this wig so I found these tracks um, I can't even tell you what brand where it's from I don't even know what color this is it's, it's not really a purple purple it's like a pinkish purple sort sort of you know pinkish purple so I don't know um but it is human hair and so I had this hair I used this hair in one of my old videos a ponytail video and what I did was I glued it down with uh, glued several tracks in my hair with the salon pro now I want to let y'all know one thing with the glue what you have to do is let it get tacky before you put it in your hair because if you put the glue on a track and then just put the track directly on your hair it's not gonna stick if you let it get tacky it's gonna get tacky enough to stick and it won't really go anywhere um so that is like a little tip and everything to take the hair glue out you can use the uh, salon pro 30 second hair bun remover um, to take the hair out because this is just a, a temporary hairdo it's not permanent you can you know switch up the colors and stuff now I could have went a little bit funkier than the style that I came up with in the video I could have spiked it up like this or something like that but um, I realized that uh, during the video this razor that I was using is not sharp enough and I did my best using the scissors to at least give it like a razor cut tip and for it to blend a little bit in the black original one number one hair that it is you know so I could have funkied it up a little bit by spiking it but I think I could do more as well as add more tracks later on in the future when I get a better razor so for now this is what we gonna work with for now and this this hair is a um this wig is a human hair wig so I can um curl it and all that other stuff too but um I just decided not to do all of it I just decided to go with the simple style which is you know just wet it and I swooped it to the side and everything but um you know you have your choices you have different alternatives to manip manipulate the wig to do whatever you want it to do um when you add tracks to the to the wig anyways yeah so um this is just a little short tutorial on how to add tracks to your hair to your wigs my bad I'll tell you you know what whichever one you want to go with I'll work with it's all up to you I just like doing that. That is like so cool to me. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do though when I get a better razor. I just need a better razor. Anyways, this is your girl Giggs. I don't waste too much of y'all time already. This is your girl Giggs. Bye! Not real hard, it's plain and simple. Not real hard.